I object. Stop the wedding. Stop the wedding. Stop the whole thing, dude. Okay, everybody, I had to start immediately filming because you wouldn't believe this. I am pretty convinced I have just spawned right next to a possible wedding on Bloxburg. Take a look at this. There's a sign. There's, it's literally a billboard. It says Bloxburg Venue. And over here, we literally have people waiting in line and... Yep, it's official. Guys, this girl right here said, I can't believe today is the day, James. I want this day to be as special as possible. Guys, I don't think I'm getting involved with any of this because I don't like online dating. And oh, God, they're, they're looking right at me. Um, oh, crap. They're looking right at me. Oh, now they're saying stuff to me. Hey, I'm not being fake. I just, I didn't expect to talk to people that are getting married. Look, she's in her dress and everything. He's in a nice suit. Christy, this girl, I'm assuming this is the person who's getting married, said, please, would you join us at our wedding? It would mean everything to us. And James said, yes, we would love to have you. They're online dating. They're probably kids. I mean, this is just actually a disaster. I'm going to say, oh, I would, but... And, and Christy said, someone of your status at our wedding. Oh, God, guys, you, you, get, you, get a, you get a verification check on Roblox and suddenly you're hot stuff. Bro, I'm... I'm flattered. I just don't think it's okay to like oh, OD online date. And wait, Christy's saying, you know, we're not kids. We're adults. Does that make it better? What's better or worse? Kids online dating and getting married on Bloxburg or adults getting married on Bloxburg and not in real life. And she said, we met on Bloxburg. We wanted to have our wedding here. Oh my gosh. You know, I actually am not going to lie, guys. I've seen cool gaming stories like that. I'm not going to get judgy, okay? I'm not. They said it's so special to us. Okay, I'm just going to say, you know what? I, I love that. I actually love that. And she said, please join us. Guys, she has been begging me to come to this wedding. I'm going to say, fine. I'll... Pull up. I didn't expect to go to a wedding today at Bloxburg, but I guess that's what's going to have to happen. She said, you're a huge part of this community. Yay. And James saying wonderful. Th th thank you. But th please, it's your special day. Now I'm now I'm going along with that. Okay. Guys, comment down below what you think. Should I keep my, my facial hair? Should I leave it? Should I keep it? I said, should I leave it twice in a row? So, all right. Well, guys, I guess I'm going to get behind this guy uh, named Zach. Wait, what the? This guy's like literally stealing my whole flow. Um, wait, and Christy literally said to me, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. Is it something I said? I said, but you change. I'm sorry, but you change. Me change? It's, um, black tie formal. Oh, there's a, there's a dress code at the Bloxburg wedding. All right, I love it. You know, guys, no, no, it's all roleplay, bro, okay? You know what? I'm, I'm down with it, okay? So, uh, I'm gonna let this guy know, though, before anything, I'm just gonna say, uh, nice hair, okay? Because it's kind of like mine, but it doesn't matter. It's, it's dyed. So, I'm gonna go back home, and I'm gonna change. Big shout out to the fan of the day. Much appreciated for using star code poke. Guys, we are about to pull up right now, so let me get into my outfit. Let me see if I can get this first try. Ready? Boom. Oh, I thought it was that one. Nope, and not that one, definitely. That was from another video. Oh, there we go, finally. Black attire, just like the dress code was, guys. Guys, take a look, Z. Oh, I'm dripping. Okay, so now we're gonna pull up and we are gonna go in. But before I do go in, guys, I did notice something off about this home. You guys take a look over here. You will see that it is literally a boarded up garage. Why would the wedding venue have a boarded up garage? So I'm literally just gonna kind of take a little bit of a look, Z. And okay, what are we noticing? We're noticing a pink door. Okay, and why is it boarded up? Why would it be? Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see like a little staircase. I think. Wait. Oh, someone's out here. Um, and Christy said, hee hee. Oh, I'm just gonna say, yo, like my suit. Okay, I, I definitely was just looking a little bit. I was curious. And Christy is so happy you can make it. I know, right? And Christy said, you look so nice in your suit. Oh, please. I'm just gonna say, thank you. Appreciate it. And then she just said, but I'll let the bachelors talk. Hee <laughs> hee. Um, what the crud? Oh, okay. I'm gonna talk to this guy. I don't know if she flirted with me. You know, I'm actually gonna maybe go with that. It was actually a, a typo, okay? Maybe she meant to say about a, a, a smiley. No, it was, she was not. She has a big day today. James is now saying, bro, I'm so nervous. Guys, why is he nervous? It's literally a Bloxburg wedding. You really? And he just said, I thought this would be easier in person, but I don't know. Um, something tells me that a wedding in person would be way more stressful. Are you kidding me? He said, my heart is pounding. Okay, I'm just gonna calm him down. I'm just gonna say that's normal. It's my first Bloxburg wedding as well. So I'm a, I'm a little confused guys you know it's definitely my first and i'm kind of freaking out here okay i'm just gonna let him know like you got this bro okay we're gonna go in you get married bada bada boom you know like you get it done hey guys i don't know what this guy has to worry about except the winky face that she did give to me that was like actually weird bro and no lie like they're adults so like it's it's chill but like stay loyal bro and james has said but i just get a bit nervous christy is a bit money driven 
Um, another word for gold digger. Uh, what? And he just said, anyways, I'm overreacting. Let's go inside. Something tells me he's not overreacting, but guys, I guess we're going in. Here we go, guys. Time to go into the wedding venue. And oh my gosh, what is happening here? I'm just gonna say, uh, hi. All right, everyone's saying hello back to me. Uh, Zach literally just said, nice hair. Okay, I might have a problem with that guy, bro. We'll find that one out later. Anyways, Matthew just said, you got to try the meatballs. Ooh, the meatballs actually do look kind of busting. I, I actually might be down for that. Oh, he said Matthew wants to give you this item. Ooh, Matthew's giving me the meatballs. Okay, I'll, I'll sauce one in. Mmm, okay. Then try some, bro. Ooh, these are kind of good, bro. Let me just keep going. He just said, these are holy. And James said, this is our priest, Matthew. Okay. Wait a minute. Is he got the... Yeah, guys, look at He's got the little white buckle right there. He is a, he is a certified priest. So you will be bringing this couple together? Wow, actually, the... <laughs> I can say a lot on Bloxburg. And he said, haha, I've known these two for years. That's so sweet, guys. You know, but no, wait. This is actually kind of interesting still, all right? I'm gonna go and get some more meatballs and other foods and other stuff. But until then... Wait, what the crap? Why did Christy... The why did the wife just private message me? He, 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 uh, what? And now she just, now she's just talking to James. Okay, guys, more and more sus signs are showing up. This is actually getting weird. All right, I'm just gonna go over here. Maybe I'll talk to this Anna girl, guys. I'm just gonna say, uh, hey, you know, maybe we're all adults here. Maybe I'll find the love of my life. No, guys, I'm just kidding. I'm not online dating, believe me, especially on Blocksburg. Nice to meet you. You know, I'm just being friendly. I said, hi, what? Uh, no, no, nothing. Um, okay, everyone's a little bit more awkward. She said, she said, I'm eating. Okay, me too. Gosh, this is, this is giving me weird wedding vibes. All right, I'm just gonna eat this corn mac and cheese bread or whatever. And <laughs> Wait, stop. That's the same door from earlier. Wait a minute. That's the pink door that was through the garage. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on. Christy's saying something. She said, everyone, I have an announcement. Wait, what the crud is going on? Guys, what did I just tie myself into? Said, the wedding will begin soon. Yay. Said, but I want to let everyone know. Oh, wait. What the heck is going on here? And she said that the donations you brought can be given to me at any point. Oh, do donate donations. I mean, you know, you do have wedding gifts, I think. We really appreciate it. Yeah, uh, of, of course. Of course. Yeah, donations. Okay. And Christy said it would just help us start our life. Would start, start what? Your next plot? Like, what do you mean your next life, bro? Christy said and get our dream house. Since so, um, right now. If anyone wants to donate, um, wow. You know, remember earlier, guys, when, when the husband said that she was money driven? Maybe she is. Well, I guess I'll do a little bit of a donation. Sounds good. I got you. Guys, I have officially sent 2,500 to Christy in the corner. You guys could see it. It's going to say, enjoy. Oh my God, guys. As I'm drinking my, my drink, she just says, that was so nice of you. You are so sweet. He, he, he. What the crud is going on? Okay. She said the wedding will begin soon. She said, hey, Zach. And honestly, it threw me off because my name is Zach IRL. Wait, guys. She literally just said, you haven't gotten anything yet. You could donate. And Zach just said, I got money, lol. Who the heck is this guy? Um. Guys, the wedding is about to begin, but I am noticing James and Christy are about to talk outside, which is going to give me enough time to go check out this purple room right here. Or pink room or whatever the color. But honestly, though, I need to hear what they're going to say first, because what just happened? She literally just kicked out his, like, best friend or something, bro. And James just said, I can't believe you kicked out my best man. Oh, my God. That is actually messed up. She said, I can't believe you let the bum at our wedding. And he said, I've known him since I was eight. And she said, he is broke. Okay. Okay. That's, first off, wow. Second off, I think I have enough time, but I need to distract this Anna girl. And I'm just going to let her know. I'm just going to say, Anna, do you think anything is going on weird here? To be honest, she just keeps eating, which nothing wrong with it. But like, she noticed, she just said, go away, I'm eating. Got it. Okay, you know what? It doesn't even matter. I, she, yeah, she's distracted and I am going to go through this door right now, guys. I am going to do it. All right, we're going to open up the door. We're going to take a look, guys, and I see some sort of, yeah, that's what I saw earlier through there. All right, guys, it's official. After the wedding, we are going to go and, oh, crap. Um, oh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna make an excuse. I was looking for the bathroom. My bad. I was looking for the bathroom. My bad. Oh, crap. I, I, I think that was a good excuse. And she just said, he, the wedding is about to start. Winky face said, you won't want to miss it. What is about to happen? Um, 
Okay, here we go, guys. I'm gonna go outside. It seems everyone's getting ready for the big day. Guys, the priest Matthew has just said, everyone, please be seated. And I just noticed something. He doesn't even have shoes, dude. Like, who is this guy? I had to come in as a dress code. I never wear shoes to begin with on Roblox, but he said the wedding will begin soon, chewing. And he's literally eating the meatballs from earlier. Guys, I just like cannot believe this is happening. This poor guy named James, he's living in delusion. This might be one of the worst weddings I've ever been to, and I've been to one. Oh my gosh, guys, I just turned around and Take a look. It's literally Christy. And she just said, Phew, here comes the bride. Like the song. Uh, editor, play a good wedding song just for a fact. Here we go. She's walking down right now. And wait a minute, guys. I just realized she's over there. Guys, what a beautiful... Oh, she's looking to the right. Uh-oh. Ah, James! What is he doing here? And James just said, dear... Right now, during our special moment, guys, it's literally his best friend. This is so messed up. And she just said, make him leave now. And James said, I, uh, okay. Oh my gosh, guys, there ain't no way, bro. He's literally going up to his bro and he's literally telling him to leave. What a piece of poop. He said, hey, listen, you need to leave. He just said, this ain't even blank day. Who the? Guys, I actually have no idea what the crap is going on. And she just said, okay, let's start again. And all because they kicked out that guy, bro. All right, she's walking down again. This is absolutely insane, bro. She literally made that guy leave, bro. He was like 50 feet away, by the way. All right, and now they are both down at the line. And Matthew just said, ah, yes. Now we may begin. Guys, finally, we have finally gotten to the wedding part. He just said, today we are gathered to... Oh! And she cut him off and said, wait. Like, actually cut off what he said below. I don't. I have no idea what he said. Now Christy is making everyone wait in the crowd. Too bad there's only two of us now. Christy said, we are accepting final donations. Anyone? And James said, here we go again. Guys, I feel so bad for this guy. I honestly hope they divorce. Christy said, honey, even you? She's asking her own husband for donations? Ain't no, 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 no way. She said, you could donate, you know? There is no way that this is happening, y'all. She said, how about you, Father Matthew? Okay, while this is going down, guys, I'm I'm actually going to go in that pink room. I have been actually waiting. Okay, she's looking right now. She won't even notice. I'm going to go in. All right, I'm going to figure out what is going on in this room, guys. It has been way too built up. Locked. No, it's literally it's locked. She may have locked this door, guys, but luckily I am a smart man and I know for a fact. Can you even lock garages? Let's go. Wait a minute. I hope I can get through these like wooden panels. Come on. I got to like sneak. Oh, it worked. Okay, guys, I snuck through, and dude, there literally is some sort of staircase right here. We're about to get to the bottom of this right now. Here we go. Three, two, one. One? Wait, there's... What the crap? What the... What in the donation list? And there's me. There's another name, and another name, and another name that... I haven't even seen these people today. 2,500 from me. 750 from this person. 243 from this person. 23, and then... It says anything under 250 is ignored, LOL, by Christy. What the mom did I just walk into? Guys, okay, let me get back. Let me go back out of here. I, I, I have enough knowledge now to expose the whole world. You know those people that say I object? It's about to be me. Oh my gosh, guys, I just ran back and Matthew said, do you take James as your husband? And she said, I do. No, 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 no. And Matthew said, James, do you take Christy as your wife? And he said, I, I object. Stop the wedding! Stop the wedding! Stop the whole thing, dude! He said, what? And Matthew said, awkward. I'm gonna go get more of those meatballs. No, literally, though. She has been talking to me different, James. She kicked out your best man, which, by the way, like, literally, your best man of the wedding. Like, how, that's not even... That's not fair. And she is using you for money bro she's just using you for money and christy just said no i am not he is lying oh really and she just said james bb and james said yeah it's not like that james you told me you were worried about her money driven life so i don't know and christy just said say you do no no no, don't say it bro said, hey, we can live happily ever after and james looking at me saying bro you're so jealous well at least he's not saying i do because guess what well how about you follow me and see what i found in this house you ready let's go come on bro. You just wish you could have her. I don't want her at all, bro. Believe me. And Matthew said, this is getting good. And he's chewing. Let's go. Come on. Follow me. And I had to go through the garage. So we're just going to go over this way. Come on. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's show you. Ready? We're going to have to go into first person. Zoom in. Follow me. Come on in, bud. And down here. Guys, I have officially brought James down here. He's taking a look at the donation list. And guys, now the exposing is coming out. James, I'm so sorry, but 
She's a gold digger, bro. Like the biggest and gold digger, like actually. Oh, she ran away. Where, where did she go? Guys, oh my gosh, James. I'm so sorry, dude. I, I don't know what to say. James said, I can't believe this. Wait, what the heck? I see her up there. Come on down. Hello? Face your husband, bro. Literally, come face your husband like a real woman. Guys, to think I was invited to this wedding in the beginning, it is an absolute disaster. It said, you ruined my marriage. I didn't ruin anything. You ruined it yourself. And Chrissy said, too bad I have six Jameses. Oh my Lord. Um, go get some help. And guys, I'm looking at James. He said, Poke, you were right. And he said, everything really is just about money with her. Come on, bro. Let's get out. Let's get the heck out of here, bro. Come on, buddy. Let's go. I'm letting him know. Sorry about that. But guys, if I never showed up, none of this would have happened. So maybe it's a good thing. He said, I dodged a huge bullet there. Yes. Yes, you did. Yes, you did, my friend. 